felt. 3-1 win away to Scunthorpe United and Wrexham go back to the top of the league. How are you feeling after that one? Yeah, obviously delighted with a win. Um, I thought we started really well in the first half. We scored two, could have really had four or five. The keepers made some great saves, a couple of scrambles and, and uh, then they get a goal with the first real attempt. And I felt second half, it probably that goal lifted them for 10, 15 minutes, but we weathered that little period and then then I thought we played with real quality and, and created numerous chances and obviously the third goal is, is a moment of quality which wins us the game. You mentioned those chances in the first half and then we've scored two but how is Jordan Tonnicos not got his name in the score sheet today? So unlucky he's had two cleared off the line, you know, incredible really but he, he's dangerous in the opposition box as he's shown tonight. Uh, yeah, and you know, two, we were comfortable at 2-0 and I didn't really feel threatened and like I say, the goal knocked us a bit, which you know, goals do, but I thought we reset ourselves well. Um, you know, Scunny have scored three goals in the last three games at home, so there's always that belief in them that they can get goals and kick into to their home end in the second half. I thought they started quick, uh, but like I say, we just dug deep, did what we had to do and came through the other side of that period with some, some really great attacking football. We've seen some good wins at home lately, but how important and was it to prove we can do it on the road again as well? Yeah, we've, we know we can. There's no, there's no doubt about that. Um, the home form is exceptional. Um, I don't know where we are in the away form, the league table, but we're not far off the top in that as well. But the standards have been so high at home. Um, you know, sometimes it is difficult to replicate it, um, but we did today. You know, we, we were excellent in control for, I'd say, 75 minutes of the game and um, in any game of football you're never going to completely dominate there's always going to be periods where you have to stand strong and, and we did that and once again we stood here talking about goals from Palmer from Hayden from Mullin but it showed that all three bring to the team again today yeah so important um, you know Polly back in the team and, and Dolby was unlucky not to keep his place if it were on us because I thought he was outstanding on Sunday uh, but Ollie's responded well with a good all round performance and a good goal so a great bit of play by by Moores and, and then Aaron does what he does and, and scores and then the third goal in the six yard box again where strikers want to be and, and it just killed the game off and you can see that the spirit was just knocked out of him. Talking about Aaron, it's his ninth goal of the season, have you ever had a centre back like that? Not not as prolific as Aaron and um, yeah and I was just so pleased for, for Azza because uh, not just his goals, this is just his general play. The times when he drove forward with the ball out from the back, you know, he looked a, a top class player and uh, pleased for him. Um, you know, very pleased. He's, he's got good players around him, there's a good spirit in the group. And I just said to the lads afterwards, you know, McAlinden's come on, and I thought it was really, really good when he came on. Um, Tommy O'Connor's come on and, and was excellent. And Dobbs as well, I say, could have shown disappointment, uh, but he came on, ran the channels for us, and just relieved that bit of pressure in the closing stages. Now we move on to Wilson on Saturday. Slightly different week having played on the Sunday and the Wednesday. Does it affect preparations at all? Um, what now? Tomorrow off. We want to get back on the road as quick as we can tonight. Feed the lads on the coach. Um, get them rested as much as we can tomorrow. And then we'll train down in, in London on, on Friday. Um, so it's all about just resting now and just, just being ready to go again. We said before the game that you know let's not hide away from a win today. Gets us on the coach top of the league. You know <laughs> we went through the points we felt we had to achieve to get there, but the goal was there. That you know we want to be on the coach bouncing down to Wilson on Friday and. Um, um, you know, I'm so pleased with the win. Fantastic support again. You know, on a Wednesday night, all the way across the M62 to get the supporters out and the numbers like they did today was fantastic. And I'm so pleased we've rewarded them with another win. Brilliant. Thanks so much, Phil. Congratulations. Thank you.